This woman stood guard over her river for 503 days and endured beatings and harassment to stop the building of a mini hydroelectric plant. Reku smo branili 503 dana. Fizički 24 sata. Ako bude potrebno, brančemo je još 5300 dana. Brančemo je dovijeka dok postoje ovdje ljudi koji su rođeni i koji žive uz ovu rijeku. Maida Bilal led a group of women in a bridge blockade to stop construction machinery from accessing the Krčitska river, where the government had approved a hydroelectric plant despite local protest and dissension. The construction site could only be accessed by one wooden bridge, so the woman occupied it 24 hours a day through the heat, rain and snow from July 2017 to December 2018. Bilal lost her job and the group was attacked and arrested by the police, but they didn't stop their peaceful blockade. I želim da moja devojčica koja kada odraste se ne susretne sa ovim problemom koji je njena mama vodila. Bilal co-founded Eco Bistro, a grassroots organization that organized protest and legal action against the permits for the dams. The courts eventually withdrew the permits, ending the blockade, and the bridge was renamed in honor of the women who protected it. The Krčitska River is in Bosnia and Herzegovina, which has recently seen a rise in hydroelectric projects. This region has some of the most untouched wilderness in Europe, and has biodiversity hotspots and endangered and endemic species. Dams and development can severely impair these ecosystems and have a profound impact on people living near the rivers. My motivation and motivation of my family is the whole river. This is not the river of my childhood. It was with a bigger capacity of water, with a beautiful court, prelijepim talasima života gdje sam odrasla i svoje djetinstvo znači vežem uz rijeku jer kilometri gdje se nalazi moja kuća cijelim selom protiče ova rijeka i svi raspusti i svi slobodni trenuci su bili moji provedeni uz rijeku. In 2021, Bilal was awarded the Goldman Environmental Prize for her work saving her river.